Hey, welcome back to the Multiverse, still flying the Carnelian. Um, we're doing great. I don't see how things could go bad. Oh, wait. There's this giant red thing blinking. I wonder what that could entail. Anyway, let's see what this is. Oh, it's you. Hi. I didn't know you actually showed up on the map. Um... Yeah, we've seen you, right? Who are you? Uh, yeah, we've done this. So, is it gonna give us a third contract now? Yeah, it does. Okay, cool. Accept the bounty to the colonizer. Okay, so this is new then. I guess the tip was good after all. Noodles are cashing in that favor. White Stranger, I'll send you his coordinates to keeping them trapped in a car. Yeah, uh, nothing here either then, huh? Good fan of fire's burst of slow moving flak, target anything, salt projectiles, lasers, drones, you name it. That's kinda cool. Travel these additional damage additional system damage to adjacent rooms, this upgrade version has more damage. Damn dude, look at all this stuff. Uh, we don't need this, uh, we don't need that. So what we do need is repairs which you are not offering. We'll still fight our way out. I wonder if they're stupid enough to stay in the door zoom until they get into weapons. No. Okay, so they do scatter. Well, aren't you guys super lucky? See if you're willing to try that one again, huh? Hmm. 
Okay, so we got a bounty. We do want to get healed before we get to that. Um. Okay, does he have anything that looks dangerous? Not really. This is usual then. You're getting in, aren't you? Dang. Right. You guys get to shoot at us for a little bit. Still need quite a few dodges from you, right? Yeah, you're not not really close to. Uh... Fully leveled. Cool. Hey, there's a store. Um, yeah, it means it's good enough for a war, right? And you get a fight out of it as well, so definitely worth. Okay, get rid of this. Autocannons. Didn't even bother to leave the pilot in place. Look at you. I mean, yeah, could get a the recon teleporter isn't that important right now, and I don't think we need to switch at this point to clone bay. Mm. What can we do when the lab as far as mantises go? Selective killing. Fireflies. No. Observational learning. <laughs> Claw slash. Regular Mantis gain a slash ability that does 15 damage to all enemy crew in the room. Can only be used twice per jump. That's kind of neat, but how often do you find a normal Mantis nowadays? 9 times out of 10 it's one of these, and then if you're lucky you can find a Suzerain or something. And your parents pay as double for each jump. Install some internal upgrades. Let's get the uh shield bypasses in here, isn't it? No. 
Or should bypass, yeah, that's okay. Um, I think for now that's fine. Let's upgrade engines one more. These normal vessels patrolling the beacon because your federation status, they don't mind you. Okay, cool. Again, if you don't need to cause trouble, then we won't. Do I not have a deconstructor? Because I got some drone parts I'm willing to part with. Ignore. Uh, let's start breaking down the missiles first. Try to be here, oh yeah, as if we we'll failed. Oh, that's rude. I guess we don't really need the lockdown here. Yep. Yeah. Right, they have that. to get. Um, do we need backup battery? Probably not. Yeah, let's just leave here then. the med bay. I can make the um, nanobots, right? Medical stimulants. Extra movement speed. Huh. I'll take the um, med bot dispersal, though, I think. Crew can heal anywhere on the ship. 25% speed of the crew. Yeah. So that basically nullifies borders ever being a problem. Um, if you get bored, we power our med bay and... Also said we can appears to be an orchid martian attacked by a pirate vessel. Yes, of course. We always save the orchids. Or wow, really send over one orchid. Yeah. That wasn't wise, was it? Oh, 
I don't think I need to worry about what just got shot. And that's a bomb. That's a bunch of bombs. Okay, with two lines in there, I don't know how much longer the air would have lasted, so... Whilst it's not a problem for the crystals, the Mantis might die. Come on in. done with that. How's our engine guy doing? Still learning. Charge Colonel. Orcus, thank you for your assistance. They explained that they were sent to sell their Colonel weapons to the militia vessels in this sector. As payment for your help, they offer one for free. How kind. See, this is why we like the Orchids. You must be getting up there, right? Yeah. Only three more? Okay, cool. The bounty is gonna be an interesting one too. We don't we never know what to expect, or it's all new there. He's like, Rubship is here waiting for you, you can't quite make out Ugh oh, hi Beam Master. Work on a new intro for my streams. Well there you go. I think it's pretty cool. You don't have to tell me I know you think it's cool. Yeah, it is pretty cool. That'll give you a little taste of my beam master. Alright. Let me know when you're ready, and I'll um, I'll try to act scared for streaming purposes. Oh, oops! Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. You can handle this, right? See, my crew isn't shielded. You can hit them with your beams. Well, maybe not. More beams. Look at you. Look at you. Yeah, that's still gonna take a while. I wonder how quickly that's gonna be when it's... If it's level 3 medbay, it should heal at like, what? One and a half the speed of a level 1? Every room's a medbay. A truly hideous colored auto ship. <laughs> that's one way to start a conversation. It's flying in circles around the area, attempting to scan nearby planets. Hi! All foreign vessel, this is Hudson AI, colonial ambassador to Her Majesty the Queen. Identify yourself and your allegiance to the mother country. Is that Russia? Calibrating, please hold. In the signs of the other ship makes a series of beeping and booping noise. Calibrate the motherland, land of Her Majesty the Queen, marry the. L, what's L? Is, that, is L 50? I think L's 50. So that would make it. 58. You're going to suggest your savagery. Former scans of nearby regions suggest technological insufficiency. Time dilation sphere suggests foreign... Oh, this is the thing we needed to destroy. The distance closer could it be. Competition for the mother country. You still haven't said what the mother country is. Also, are you sentient? Yes, this has an eye clean message. Your Majesty the Queen and not repeating myself in the glorious year zero. When Your Majesty ascended to the eternal throne, the mother country became the one true empire. Never before has time or space seen such a benevolent 
and Mediocratic Society. Under the rule of Her Majesty, civilization has been brought to all corners of the multiverse we have yet reached. My siblings and I have been dispensed... Dispensed, that's one way to put it. Across all no realities to identify suitable locations for Imperial settlements. Your reality is different. You're all savages. There's no dignity left here which suggests this reality is perfect for future colonial ambitions. Submit, savage, we will show you what true civilizations look like. No place in heaven for those who reject the ambitions of the crown. If you will not submit willingly, that will render you impotent. Ah. You're gonna shoot crew at me or something, aren't you? Mind control bomb. Okay. Oh, choice because it actually needs to hit something, but. I almost feel bad for the guy. Almost. He's getting good at targeting crew, though. What happened? Oh, you left. Right on time. Annoying little fart there, aren't you? Seriously, this isn't normal anymore, right? This thing can target crew. How the hell did you pull that off? Again, it's really cool that you've managed to do it, but how? Yeah, the fact that they've always hit a room that had screw in it means there are some hyperspace shenanigans going on.
certainly keeping me on my toes. I just hope it doesn't give me a weapon, because again, we can't use weapons, we just don't have the system slots, the weapon slots for it. Person I downed. Savage, do you think you have achieved anything? The mother country has no limits to its expansion. You have merely laid our arrival, not postponed it indefinitely. Perhaps your progeny will be more willing to welcome true civilization. Yep, colonizer bomb. Called it. <laughs> You've done almost excellent work. If only I'd been there to see it. Not a weapon. See that sort of mind control bomb? How delightfully devilish. I can only assume this would be illegal if not for its non-existence in this cluster until now. Well, here's your copy, stranger. Please, pleasure doing business with you. Did you like stop fighting? There's no enemy ship here either. My goes one crew in the enemy in the room. My control duration 15 seconds. Soft up protecting device. That mind controls enemy crew in the room if there aren't any already. If there aren't any already, okay. So you can't use fire well, you can't just fire two of them on the same room. And we struck by this weapon will fall in the effect of mind if applicable. The effect will not inherit the bonus from any upgraded mind control system you may own. Cool party trick. I'll give it that. So, this thing doesn't exist in this universe, but I already have a price tag for it. <laughs> Expect to find a well-stocked Federation market as much as Beacon instead. There's only a small station and one single patrol ship. Hopefully there's enough to stock up on your journey here. Yep, this is my old girl. Fancy bit of history. Me and the boys kept them in running shape since the war with the mat. It's interesting buying some, something as old as she is. Sure. Living history lad, you know, be careful with them. These guys are built for ship construction and spatial exploration, not war. They do make good for good crew as long as you have no better alternative. HP on your frail ship construction, bad repair speed, combat damage enables to suffocate, target takes more damage from fire, can be upgraded using scrap and drone parts. Hmm. One of these just as a buffer. And we could still use a different weapon. Wouldn't be opposed to it. And number of arms sends to pursue our teammate starts to cough and falls in a spasm to the floor. Drag him back to the med bay. Hold him down, medway zip stop whatever neurotoxins on the ship from fully infecting your crew. Once you recover, you prepare to fight off scientists who are beyond help. And they could choose to fight us in the med bay. Okay. Eat your heart out, clone bay. Alright, well that's gonna do it for this episode then. Thank you guys for watching up the series. See you guys on the next episode. Bye everyone.